After 20 years of teaching, Promise Tokwana retired to focus on her life and family. But a routine medical checkup revealed that her goal of a healthy, happy retirement was in danger. A few years ago, when I went to the doctor uh, for checkup, he discovered that uh, I was hypertensive. And then he told me that your, 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 your blood pressure is very high. It was about 183 over 100. I was shocked. I even said, no, but man, I, I, I don't have this. There was that thing in me that I don't have this hypertension. I don't. I got a wake up call when my heart was pounding as if it was about to go out of my mouth. I said, no, this is really serious now. And then, and then he said to me, your chances are very high if ever you have a parent that has hypertension. But it lies at dormant, it's not active. And then it's only, it only comes or it's aggravated by your lifestyle. You think, what am I going to do? There's no, there was no balance in my diet. That is the, the, the green veggies, uh, uh, the yellow ones, grilling and so forth, no. If I feel like frying, I just fry. Uh, immediately after eating salty food, my heart will go very, very, very fast. Eating again, you did not exercise and then you eat just before you go to sleep. That was also very, very dangerous for me. And then no exercise, nothing. I'm just sitting and I'm tired. So I say salt, goodbye. Salt, goodbye. To manage her hypertension, Promise takes medication and has changed the whole way she eats. After years of grabbing fast food on the go in between classes, Promise became a student herself as she set out to find what was best for her health. I had to go out and find out what good food is for my body, the good nutrients and apples, um, cabbage, uh, garlic. For example, um, broccoli. So I do have them here, apples that are there to protect my heart. I have broccoli, right? Broccoli, which is good, very good for my heart as well. And then for cooking, to make cooking my cooking faster, I do have this uh, crushed garlic as well. I've got fruit, I'm high on veg now, veggies. I eat, I steam my veggies. I don't even cook my veggies. I steam them so that I have all the nutrients in my veggies. Promise found a local free outdoor gym in her neighborhood and started exercising four times a week to improve her heart health and more easily manage her weight. She found that taking control of her own health became contagious. As I was conscientized, I went to the chemist, I bought the, 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 the machine that you use to, to, to monitor the blood pressure. I have it. I feel so healthy. I feel so healthy and I'm light. I'm no longer that tired. You, you see that people are so ignorant. And this hypertension is not for, for or it's not, it doesn't uh, only attack that is fed people, even thin people. So prevention is better than cure. Because I, I was careless with my life, I really was. Yeah, the gym that I go to every morning, all right, how much? No, there's no joining fee there. You just go, it's free. It's a community thing, is it? You see, we, we become like a, a family there. Once you are not in the, and then the following day, hey, where were you? Where you? No, fine, all that. It, it, it's so nice. Processed foods are often high in salt and Promise watches her daily salt intake through reading ingredient labels. Yes, yes, I do. I do that a lot now. Talk about fat. Uh, so much fat, so much salt. Oh, I'm conscientized. I said, mm, too much salt, sorry, not for me. I, I think now a person or people should take a responsibility about their health. They must take responsibility. I feel that I've been so much empowered by this awareness such that I'm going to live longer than because I look much younger than my years. It's a pity a lady does not say her age in public, but I know that I look very, very young. I feel so good about life now that I, it's like I'm, I'm a little girl. It's, I love myself. I wouldn't change it for anything. 
the lifestyle that I'm living now. Love it. <laughs>